Hi guys, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you about OnlyOffice and how you're going to be able to use it for various different topics as well as video and content creation and a very cool, interesting feature that it has. It does have a connector that's going to bridge OnlyOffice to WordPress and we're going to go over that right now. So thank you for joining me. All right, so let's dive in. Now, one thing that they have is a free ready to use integration app, right? So for WordPress, and this is it, right? So this is the main thing that is really makes this pretty cool. It's not only the main thing, but there's many different, well, uses that you can use and actually take advantage of. So it allows editing office documents in WordPress, as well as actually adding only office blocks in the post. Now, uh, of course, you sh if you don't know what WordPress is, of course, it's that popular free and open source content management system, right? Well, the connector and its features, right? So the integration apps and admins are able to work with Office documents and website visitors and view them in public posts, right? So this is uh, really great. So you're going to be able to edit the files in WordPress. But let's kind of go over the site first and kind of show you really what's up and how it's, how it's going. All right, so here we went in. Um, why only Office Docs, right? So you can use a connector in the WordPress plugin directory. Um, now editing the upload WordPress via admins dashboard and via interface with tabs, free community scalable, real-time collaboration, track changes, comments, chat, multiple editing, open source code available on GitHub, right? That's pretty cool. How to start? Uh, big important part, right? Uh, choose your plan and deploy only. Office Docs. Get the integration app from GitHub or WordPress plugin directory. Uh, now I'm going to click here and just go here for a moment just to show you uh, how that works. Right. So the plugin, you just click here once you go to the site and you just click download. Right. Uh, and you can see the version 1.02. Right. It was updated about nine months ago. The version 5.7 or higher. And this is how you're going to do it. Right. So all the files and media section will appear on the only Office Files page. The editor opens up in the same tab. Uh, creating a post now you can add only office element and then upload a menu file or select one from the media library All right and this is a screenshot so once you do this this is what's going to be really useful so the screenshot only office and you can see it right here right uh and document editing service address the document uh server jwt secret key uh you'll use that as well let's click and you're going to see all the screenshots that's walking you through it the file name right so uh, you're going to be able to go through and select those files uh, and you're going to be able to pull up for example here right so an eye-catching headline means a lot uh, adding all of these blocks when creating a post so you'll just click add title uh, and so forth and so on right pretty easy right so it kind of walks you through it right here off the bat which is really nice and honestly it is very considerate you know that, that they walk it through and that's one of the cool things but if you don't have WordPress, you can get WordPress just by simply clicking up here uh, and get WordPress. You can download 6.1. Uh, I would recommend this one right here if you're not quite sure how to install it. Uh, click the installation guide and it will walk you through there as well. All right. So now you know how to kind of go ahead and link everything together, right? And you configure the integration app right here. And you can actually see the detailed instructions on GitHub if you didn't quite catch that. Uh, and you can choose your only office docs, right? For enterprises, you can try it for free or pick your price or for your home use, right? So if you're using the inter the enterprises form, you have mobile web editors, desktop mobile apps, enhanced security features, professional support. Uh, if you're for homes, for semi-sized family sized teams, for non-commercial use, desktop mobile apps, mobile web editors, community support forms, and so, right? Uh, now pick your price, right? Uh, we can go up here and actually click on this pricing form so that way we don't get out of our page so you can see right pricing docs workspace for developers right so if we go to docs for a moment for business you can see it's eight dollars a month postpaid right um oh it changed sorry uh for home there we go all right home server 149 dollars one-time payment you can have 10 people on that the mobile web editors it's ready to use connectors already uh enhanced security features a lifetime license and one year update. So $149 and it's yours for life, right? This is home and you just click buy now. As far as the business line goes, let's just click uh, $1,500, bucks, right? Uh, number of connections, you can change this and edit. So you're choosing your price, right? Uh, 50 support level, basic plus or premium. You can select uh, however you want. Uh, support and updates, one year, three years, save 5%. Support disaster recovery, support multi-server. 
uh, and that totals there, right? So now the total is 4,800 bucks because we changed some stuff. But what does it have? Web editors, ready to use connectors, one year of updates, one year of professional support, and you can update and change everything that you need right there. This is on premises, or we can go to cloud. Now this is where it changed for it on this. But business, eight dollars a month, postpaid. Uh, VIP is upon request, prepaid billing, right? Uh, server, public, right? And then upon request, branding options, multi tenancy. Um, now JWT, HTTPS, uh, document editor, it has all of these to so support as well. The response time is around 48 hours. It does have email support and it has webinars, help centers as well. And you can get started there. Uh, so you can see it's, it's actually fairly cheap, especially if you're going by cloud, uh, unless you want it to, you want to use everything because what you have everything on site, right? Uh, they have doc developer conversion API, the document builder and the APS, and you can get those now. If we're going to the doc developer, right here you can see uh, and they have a wonderful video it's trusted by Fujitsu Deloitte C file uh, one suit multiple features they have right so text document editing spreadsheet editing digital form building that's really useful actually uh, and presentation editing so if you're in school they have different objects style options transitions animations PDF reading conversion that's super helpful how many times have you found a PDF and you actually need to change it right ebook creation if you're like an author, you want to make an uh, electronic book or send it. Uh, document building uh, as well. You have fun editors, lightweight tool, and easy integrations with that. The document conversion, again, APIs, the collaboration. So uh, locking, co-editing, review versions, right? So uh, if you're working on a team and they need to be able to change something, if you're writing something like for an ebook and but you have an editor, uh, they can check that out, right? Uh, so forth and so on. Uh, and document building. So 50 plus document formats are supported for viewing and switch from common view mode to live viewer mode and allow users to see changes actually made on collaborations. Very good, especially within businesses. Uh, and uh, especially I know people doing like white papers together and, and working. Uh, and, and that really helps them. It's say organize and get focused. Uh, but you have docs developer, you have the conversion API as well. Uh, the conversion supports all multiple formats as well. So image files uh, it supports 50 different documents, professional technical assistance, man, everybody needs professional technical assistance at some point. Uh, and the conversion is pretty high quality. So it provides the best possible results for conversion types and add conversion settings to define the delimiter characters when you're actually converting the CSV files. Uh, as well and you can actually check out the API documentation to learn more about the options as well and it's safe and secure right so here you can work online from any browser and operating system you can edit docs offline and free office apps for Windows Linux and Mac and you use free apps uh, apps for Android and iOS as well and you can download the mo uh, mobile apps and if I didn't mention that uh, that's a good point to actually mention to you is that uh, if for Android and iOS perfect uh, and everybody loves to be able to be more mobile, right? Uh, and the features, the spreadsheet editor, the presentation editor, right? We kind of covered all of these, the security for iOS, for Android, or for your desktop. Um, I love I love these right here. So you have Docs Cloud, Docs Enterprise, right? That's kind of what we were already talking about, uh, where you're go Docs Enterprise is exactly, uh, well, the business side of it we showed you, and Docs Cloud is the more cheaper form of everything and other integrations as well next cloud on cloud uh, I'll first go and you can see all of them as well uh, so you can get only uh, get only office docs right here uh, you can it's free to download you can go ahead and get started but you're just gonna be limited uh, web hosting get web hosting from some of the best providers so if you need web hosting as well you can get different bundles as well and you can get a code on github uh, and the connectors desktop mobile that's where you already went pricing partners uh, you can see their affiliates here, techno, uh, the techno, technological partners, uh, and you can see right here, right? So become an only office affiliate. Um, and if you want to become affiliate with them, they have a gift shop, they have different events, awards, and jobs. You can tr contribute and see their customers and get more information So for the resources as well. So uh, multiple cool things for you, right? So we're going to go over the connections in just a minute. So um why i'm talking about it. so wordpress is really really useful trust me um that is wordpress is, can always be annoying with some some people at some point and anything to make wordpress a little bit uh easier of course we're going to support so uh a fresco they have a connector for it 
as well. You can get it now. Just download it. Uh, rich web-based collaboration environment. You have Chamillo. Uh, you can open it at Docs, uh, different Vox files within Chamillo on e-learning collaboration and software, Docsx, XLSX, PPTX files. They have for a uh, connection for Confluence, uh, Drupal. They have for HumHub, Jira software as well. Uh, attachments for here, and you can actually view and edit Office documents the same for HumHum. So you can kind of get these connectors. Uh, Nextcloud for Moodle, LifeRay. Uh, you have Nexico and OwnCloud and for Plone as well. Don't worry, we're not finished yet. Redmine, we have SharePoint, Strapi, and the really cool one, WordPress, right down at the bottom. So if you're just kind of sh browsing through and you're looking for WordPress, right at the bottom and get it now. Uh, need an app to connect to only Office let, of your favorite web service? Well, develop one, let them know, message them, and show them. Uh, and this is it. So this is only Office. It's very, very cool, very, very interesting. So definitely jump in, check that out. Get connected now. Start editing your docs. Make life so much easier. Thank you guys for watching.